I am finally reviewing chicken again. The West is flourishing. Hey everyone, it's your favorite funny Minecrafter here, SpeedyCube64, and in this video I am going to be re reviewing the Cheetza. This is something I saw Review Bra do, and I was like, holy shit, that's so stupid, I have to try it too. So yes, in front of me is the Cheetza. This is gonna be more of a quick review. I don't feel like spending 20 minutes uh, talking about this thing. Um, interesting pattern on the box here. Um, it's got the kernel, it's got the stripes, you know, all that stuff. Uh, I'm not quite as prepared to review this as I may have been. Come on, focus. Also, you, might, you may notice a little better web webcam quality. I'm using my phone as a webcam now, pretty cool. Um, instead of using a shitty ass webcam. So yeah, uh, hopefully that, that doesn't fall into a backflip and reveal my face or some shit. But anyway, yeah. Um, this is what the Cheetah looks like, I guess. Now mind you, this is what it looks like after, you know, 20 minutes of me walking home from KFC. If uh, you get this and you open it right as the cashier or whatever gives it to you, then it's probably not gonna look as messy as this. Um, but yeah, let's take a piece of this. I, be I believe this is cut into like four pieces. All right, all right. The cheese is uh, a bit unorganized, I would say. The sauce is kind of all over the place. Looks like. But I mean, I guess that's sort of what you expect from this kind of thing. Um, see the inside of the box? Uh, you can see the sauce kind of fell off the chitza onto the, uh, the bag. Or not the bag, like the, the yeah, what the fuck you call this? Tissue paper? Yeah. Uh, anyway, yeah, this is the cheats uh, uh, going in, as Review Bra would say. Alright, first impression it's basically chicken parm. Uh, there's, I, I don't, I did not taste the difference between this and a regular chicken parm, but. That may be because I did not get the pepperoni in that bite, but um, yeah, I mean, I don't think KFC is quite doing anything revolutionary with this, except for sounding funny, that's it. The chicken itself is not quite as crispy as I would have hoped. Um, the sauce and cheese, I mean, they're adequate. They're just regular sauce and cheese. I, I really don't know what to tell you. Um, as I said, I was not very prepared for this review. Um, I mean, it's fine though. It's good. Uh, like it's good chicken like KFC usually does. Here's the uh, cross set section if you want to see it. Um, as you can see, those lines of chicken there mean it's actual chicken and not paste. There's the sauce and the cheese on top of it. Also, the the pepperoni kind of you kind of it's kind of hard hard not to eat the whole pepperoni piece in like one bite. Like when you when you, you can't like bite into the pepperoni, it kind of just slips off the the top of the pizza and it, the whole thing ends up in your mouth. So I don't know if you, I don't know if that's an upside, a downside, or what. That's just something I'm noticing when I'm eating it. It's definitely very salty. And that's something that I am like noting. Like this this uh pizza here is almost too saucy. Like the the I mean saucy, salty. Like the the chicken, the sauce, the cheese. And then like the pepperoni like all together, it's putting this really salty taste in my mouth. And it's not enough to make me not like this, but I mean, it definitely isn't, you know, the best balance of flavors, as you would say. Although if you're, you're getting this, you're not really expecting to have a sweet, savory, saucy, umami or whatever balance of flavor. I know Review Bra said something about how um, I don't remember if you said it was the cheese or the sauce or something that had like a, a sweet note to kind of counter the the saltiness of everything else, but I'm not really getting that. I'm just getting like salty, 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 like I don't know.
Like this thing probably has like 200% of your sodium daily value, like at least. So, I mean, after having eaten that piece, I don't know, I think I'm ready to give it a rating. Um, uh, let's see. I mean, five being average, one being the worst thing you could ever get, uh, 10 being the like, absolute best thing you could ever get. I mean, this is getting a five. It's definitely like a solid five. It's, it's not great. It's not bad by any means. It's basically chicken parm, except it's fast food. Um, so, if you're comparing it to other chicken parms, it's not nearly as good as a chicken parm you'd get in a good Italian restaurant. Um, I mean, in fact, as an Italian-American myself, uh, some might even consider it a sin that I'm eating this pizza right here. But, um, I don't know, I prefer the American pizza anyway, so that's, uh, I guess, up for debate. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna take this last bite of the little piece, and whatever speedrun is playing in the background comes to a close, um, I must just remind you that I am in the process of building a redstone computer in survival mode. So definitely check that out on my Twitch channel if you want to see me do that. Or if you just want to see what the creative build looks like, I'll link that in the description too because I have the creative version of the build done. Um, but besides that self-promotion, thanks for watching. And as always, stay speedy. Peace.